All right, Let's see what we got. 55 seconds. I'm all right, can we get you? Be strong, we can make it. Hurry, let's get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. All right, come here. Oh boy. Just go. Yeah, I'm just gonna fuck it. Just gun it! Switch to the machine gun. Start using it. He oh, I suppose that's true because he the, want to. I suppose that's true because the that thing you said use you have to fight it with the grenades, right? Yes. So really the, uh, the, the helicopter you have to fight with the grenades. Yeah, I suppose really there's no point in saving the machine gun. So this will leave me here. You have to go back to the right then? Yeah. The right? Well, no. Because technically the right is a dead is end. Is a dead end, so I gotta take that path where I fought Big Head Dude. But actually, I might as well start killing these guys to get, get the possibly. Level up. Yeah, get my level up. Because, yeah, you're close enough, you'll get max life again, so. And it's it's nice that I already killed that guy too, so now I don't have to worry about actually fighting him. Fighting him. It's so weird that they, like they just randomly two experience instead of two hundred. Yeah. See two hundred. It's very weird. Also, why does the machine gun make multiple shot sounds when you fire one bullet? Okay, so that's the now you can go now back you to, to go the helicopter. Up. Yeah. Now it's that up now. I gotta here, take right? this one. Yep. And then to the right. You only got a couple more bullets left. Yeah, I see that. Two bullets. None. Okay. Yep. And then this is where I fought boss dude. Uh, he's already dead. Oh yeah, that's right. They don't come back. Going right. Boop, boop. Okay. Oh boy. You fucking dill. Okay. Yep, then I kept going right, and then through here, because that led me back to the helicopter. Oh, oh, there you go. It goes right into the boss. You so, can so the guy, it's actually, I guess he's on the right instead of the left, like Nintendo Power said, but that guy, when you kill him, he refills all of your grenades. So the grenades, you just have to throw them at the helicopter when you are on your second to last, or I would even say you're, like, you're on number three or something like that target him so that you get your uh, your grenades. grenades back. Okay. You're at nine right now. So. Yeah, you're at nine, so start using them. Oh, I have to hit the cockpit. Yes. Yeah. Yep, there it is. One. Wow, this is crazy. This yeah. is stupid. Oh, I guess it's got to be the one that's on the left. Oh, man. Four. Well, it's weird because the missiles just Three, change direction two, all of a sudden. Uh, why is... Oh, there he is. Oh, I think you have to go towards that side of the screen. There you go. Oh, God, there's two of them now. Oh, uh, change your... Change yeah, your, it yep. switched me off because I ran out. Just keep targeting the, the helicopter. Brute force it. Brute force! Damn it! I keep hitting the Six. missiles. Oh, you're off now. Damn. There you go. Pause and switch. There, there you go. go. I'm dead. Yeah, There's no maybe. fucking way. Maybe. No, no, not maybe. I'm fucking dead. 
That's fucking stupid. <sighs> My back to POD. I sure am. Yep. I'm weak. I'm dying. Why do you. Oh. Uh. uh. Oh, boy. All right. Can I please? Oh. oh okay, geez. game. Whatever. <laughs> oh my god. Because they're both FIFA soccer games. All right, all right here, here we, go. we go again. JJ, yep, just start shooting. Why is the screen all shaky all of a sudden? Well, it's always been shaky. Wait, no, not, not this quite bad. like this. Because, like, all God this damn it! Is. Maybe if you just pause. Okay! It? Why is that guy taking four fucking grenades to the head all of a sudden? Just stay underneath the, the, like, the, the cockpit. It doesn't work. It doesn't. No, 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 I know, but when you're throwing your, your grenades, if you stay to the, like, right below it, you seem to be connecting every time. Well, am I, or am I hitting the missiles? No, I, you're I can connecting hit the missiles every, too. no, you're connecting every time. Oh. Right there. See? Right there. Right there. Oh, that one just went right through it. That was weird. Right there, right there, right there. And it's and it's fast does, too. How many hits does it take? It takes a fuck ton of hits. Respawn guys? Can uh I go to the there Yeah, go. I was gonna say, I think you have to be on the left. Or like you have to be What the hell was that? I don't know. Nice. Right, that was I That was just fortuitous. <laughs> Right, come on now. How many fucking hits? That's the the part of the problem. Well, I mean, it must have been a lot because of the fact that the game even tells you, or that it keeps spawning um, guys, guys, so that you can get your your stuff back. Yeah, but they should still be giving you experience too. I think. Oh, that's true. Oh no, they don't. They when don't. They, when they, they drop, should. there you go. God. When they drop items, that's you that get the item no instead of the experience. Yeah. yeah. All right. Fuck you then. Get on the chopper, quick! Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Goodbye, Nam. Nam. It's the Nam. That's how it's pronounced. The Nam. Sure. <laughs> this fucking song. It's wow. not the worst one we've ever heard for an NES game, though. No. To be quite honest, honest, of a song that loops continuously, I like how upbeat and just, like, poppy it is. <sighs> I guess. But, trust me, the game will not get very high marks for its music <laughs> because there is really no music in this game. I didn't say, are we crashing? <laughs> nope. We just, uh... I mean, the helicopter did explode. <laughs> and what do you gotta say? Thank you, Rambo. We knew that you could save them. You would save them. Okay. Not could. Whatever. Oh, what the God. Fuck is... Oh, is he running from you because he was bad? I don't know. I don't make orders. I take them just like you. Oh. I swear to God, this wasn't supposed to happen. It was just supposed to be another assignment. Mission accomplished. Okay. Yeah, it's a boy bad out there. Find them or I'll find you. Keep going. I think you have to go talk to uh, Troutman. Where is... Oh, it just looped. Ah, uh, go uh, south. Thank you. Go yeah, south. Yeah, you have to go oh, south. Go south. To the other side Yeah, of the to base. the other screen. Yeah, right oh. here. Troutman should be to the left, actually. Oh. Nope. Yes. Oh. Oh, there she is. What are you doing? Going to the States? Warm people, warm city, warm days. <laughs> I've been dreaming of living in the USA and having a simple life. If you don't mind. I think I learned something important from you. I may be able to live. Or love. Really? I love you! <laughs> wow, that escalated quickly. Hey, you got full life. Thanks, baby. Where is, is, is it in there? There is Troutman. Oh. You're tougher than I thought. Now, you're free. John, where are you going? I don't know. I don't this know. This is a second Medal of Honor for you. You should give it to them. 
You're free now. Come back with us. What's, What's there for me? My <laughs> friends died here. There's a piece of me did too. The war? Everything that happened, maybe it's wrong. Don't hate your country for what you've been through. Hey, I died for it. So, what do you want? I want what they want. Every other guy who came over here. I want, I want for my country to love me as much as I love it. That's what I want. What are you going to do? Day by day. Rambo, the battle is over, but... The battle is over, but... Thank you for trying. No, Adrian! I did it! Thank you for trying! <laughs> oh, now there's two Rambos. <laughs> well, at least she survived, and she we're did. in love. We, we got full life at the very end of the game when it didn't even matter. The end. Because, as video game logic has shown us, and they actually copied this from Zelda 2, she talked to you, she said, I love you, and then your life went up. Just like when Link goes into the house and the it's woman is like, and the woman is like, come in here, I will soothe you. Yeah, video game love. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Can't get VD for Rambo here, in, the, in bank. the bank. Wow. So, I am going to say this, though, and you might not agree with me. There are things that are very wrong with this game, but overall, I don't think this is a bad game. Listen, let's let's hold hold your fucking horses, all right? Let's wait. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Wait. <laughs> Rambo in the bank. Yes, Rambo is Clap, in the bank. We did it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that effect was actually pretty and, cool. And we saved and we saved Cole. We saved Cole. We did it. Yes. What a weird thing that if you talk to her down there, she gets attacked and dies. Yeah. Who would have ever thunk? I don't know. Yeah, that's but we great. did it. We found did. it. Nailed it for love. Yes. And we found a glitch, too. Kissed by a rose oh, on the green. Or whatever the fuck he said. Kissed by a rose on the green. On the green. On the green. We fucking did it. Rambo. All right. Now we'll get into it. Let's... You can't talk about what you like yet. We got to talk about fun. No, that's fine. Or difficulty. What yeah. do you give the game for difficulty? Boy! You like booty. <sighs> Tootie game fruity booty. Difficulty. I honestly... The game is really forgiving in the sense that you get unlimited lives. Yes. And the continues are basically just based off of where you last talked to somebody. And the timer, to be honest, is really kind it's, of arbitrary. That's what I thought it was going to be. Is yeah. I mean, we really took our sweet time, and we still had what I what half our time probably was gone. So ten, 16, ten, 17 hours. So probably I mean, ten we, hours yeah, left. Yeah, we had yeah, another yeah. like twenty hours. Uh, left. Oops. So I gotta, um, I gotta pull up my game ratings. So I would honestly say, as far as difficulty goes, just because they throw a lot of enemies your way, and there's going to be times where you're going to be taking hits, I, I would call it a four. I'd say it's middle of the road, but it leans more on the easy side just because of the fact that it's that you get the unlimited continues, you get the continue, the the spawn points, basically everything that you accomplish, like the uh, experience, the items that you pick up when you die, you get to keep all that stuff. So I honestly, I would, I would almost even, you know, I don't know if I would go as low as a three, but definitely a four. I. I was hovering between three and four. I was going to say... Reason being... Maybe, maybe between a three and a four, this, but it's closer to that This four. game is so vague on, like, direction and, and what you're exactly supposed to be doing. Yeah. I mean, they tell you... They tell you... Where, like, where you got to get to, but they don't tell you how to get there. Not and, really, but... Really, it wasn't that undiscernible. 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 It was not hard to figure out. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> like, common deduction, we did end up figuring it out. Yeah. It's, it... Yeah. The medicine drops were not that... It was top-heavy, and when you only have 100 life. Yes. Even, even from the point where you start having, like, 200 life, 
the game already feels like oh, it's yeah. super easy. Yeah, yeah it's it's yeah. already easier because it's like it's not you have a, a much bigger lifespan. Yeah, it's it's made harder by the sloppy mechanics. Yes, uh, I mean the hit detection. The hit is detection truly was atrocious. terrible, and that's why I said is that the game is not difficult. And overall, and we'll get there. I think it's it's pretty fun. But yes, there are some glaring flaws of this game. Oh where yeah, the hit detection is bad. The um, the controls are definitely not as tight as I would like them to be because there were plenty of times where I would try to turn around and I couldn't turn around, or like you experienced too, where you push the button to attack and he just doesn't straight up attack. Yeah. So I mean, there were times where it's like the controls just didn't seem to work. Um. And that, unfortunately, made it difficult, like, more difficult yeah, than it should yeah. have been. You're right. And it's, it's, uh, this took three and a half hours, by the way. Oh. Three and a half. That's not too bad. Not, not bad. Not bad I, at I've all, never played actually. this game before, so, uh, I mean, no, it's, yeah. Uh, honestly, that wasn't terrible. Mm-hmm. I, it was more tolerable than I thought it would be. Yeah. But that's also because of, you know you're right back to where you start when you die with, with whoever you talk to, like you said. I'm, yeah, I think four feels right. Between, oh, yeah. I, I, even when they tell you head this direction, oh, it's in a cave in the north. Well, you know to find the little N and yep, there it is. Mm -hmm. Like, that's the cave. Yeah. Like, it's kind of, it does tell you where to go. It's just, you. it takes a little bit of, of just know-how. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit of a learning curve. Yeah. But it's not bad. It's not bad. It's no. not great either. It's not great. Not bad. So I guess we'll move on to fun. Four for difficulty. I, I, I lock it in. Yeah. Fun. I weirdly, I, I think I'm kind of in the same boat as you. I think it's ambitious. I think they had a lot of really good ideas. I'm always a sucker for that experience system. I think mm -hmm. that's actually pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I, I don't mind that for a game like this. It felt good, actually, to get more powerful, even though sometimes it didn't feel like we got more powerful. Mm -hmm. But, like, I don't know. There was something, there was a weird, goofy charm about it that I didn't mind. But it had a lot of flaws. <laughs> That's why I honestly, as as far as fun goes, oh. I it, it's difficult. But I would honestly, I, I would call it I would call it a five. I would call you it. Who would say middle of the road? I, I would say middle of the road. I was kind of gonna. I was gonna go. I was gonna go four. Well, the only thing that keeps it from even lower, like a three, because let's be honest, the graphics are shit. The 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 enemies the music are not, shit. Yeah, the music is not great. The music sucks. The enemies. As far as a as, as a movie tie-in, some of the enemies um, definitely questionable. Why they chose them? Like dry bones, like like the skeleton heads, yeah. the uh, the guys that caught on fire. Yeah, the guys that caught on fire, the the lightning thingies, whatever that is, the, the robots. Were clearly, the predator. Maybe. It was yeah. They took some creative liberties. They definitely did, um, and they were programmed. I would horribly. I would understand going down to the four just because even though i i do think that this game is is overall it's it, it's it's okay it, it's yeah they really did steal a lot of stuff <laughs> <laughs> from like other games and you can tell yeah. that i don't know who inspired who but they stole a lot of mechanics and a lot of things from different games i mean obviously the Adventures of Link <laughs> was a very heavy influence on this game. Considering some of those maps were like it's almost as if exactly. they were ripped straight. Yeah, yeah. like um, from the backgrounds to the to some even just the la even, the, the, the stage layouts. Even some of the stage layouts and and uh, backgrounds reminded me and almost felt like they were lifted straight from Karate Kid as well too. Yeah, like I with the see houses that. and stuff. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, the forests, of course, and some of the enemies were straight up Adventures of Link. When did, they, when did we say this came out? 88 yeah. is... And uh, Karate Kid came out in 87. And... Huh. I'll have to double check. Because, uh, I mean, Link, we were saying that they ripped stuff from Adventures of Link, but they didn't. They didn't, because Link was 89, right? Hold on. Uh, well, was it 89 here? 
or was it 89? It may have been even earlier in Japan. So it might have been 80... Because if it... I mean, you can see the parallels. It's, yes. it's almost too much of a coincidence. And I would not... <sighs> it was released for the the family computer disk system on January 14th, 1987. And Adventure of Link? Yeah, Adventure of Link. So, okay. So S that was in Japan, obviously. But, right, um, right, 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 right. But I would still say, I mean, in... December of 1988 was the NES. Uh, let me see Rambo. Eight December of 87 for Japan. For Rambo? Yeah. So, so they pretty much did. They did. Okay. They did Rambo. All right. Yeah. So Link was already out by then. Link was already out uh, January. Rambo like, would have already been in development, too, by that point. Yes, so. it would have. Okay. Yeah. So a lot of the assets and the backgrounds and stuff, yeah, it, it's it's clearly it's, yeah. heavily inspired by, mm -hmm. by Adventure of Link. Very for much sure. So. Yeah. So yeah, it's it's I the 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 graphics are funny and bad for the most part. I mean, some of those bosses why their heads get big, uh, I don't know, but it just seems kind of a it seems cartoonish. Yeah. Like something you would have seen in like a Tiny Toons game. Yeah. Uh the the graphics weren't great. The music I love that 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 first Yeah, I know you love that fucking song. I love that first tune, but honestly like that's literally it. You have <laughs> you have that background music. You know when you walk into a town because the music changes yeah. to something more subtle. You know when a boss is. You know when a boss is on the screen, and that's literally those three, those pretty, three tunes. Pretty much. That's it. And I will say, context out the ass. They really never left you wondering about what's happening in this game. So there was a lot of dialogue, yeah. a lot of context. Quite a bit. And yeah. she actually looked pretty good. Like, yeah. the face thing for her looked really it good. It actually looked like the actress, yeah. Yeah, and it, as Stallone, stupid as, as Stallone, Stallone looked, did, did, well, it kind of yeah. kind of captured him. Not when he's screaming, though. Not oh, with no, the... No. He looked like a WWE knockoff yeah. of Stallone. But it actually didn't mm -hmm. look horrible. I'm... I... <sighs> But then you have, like, the inconsistency with weapons and damage. That, like, a lot of the... It just... There were so many things that fell short. That, I think like, the I think the inconsistencies and just the way that the controls were, I think I'm going to have to bump it down to that four. I'm, I'm thinking I, as well. So so that's why I'm, I'm kind of torn, because I think, like you, like you said, and that may be the best way to describe it, this game was ambitious... And you could tell that, like, they they did quite a few things right. Even though they're copying, I mean, there are some games that try to copy, a, like, a formula and they still get it wrong. Yeah. This one copied a formula, but it got it right. Yeah, it didn't do too bad. And so it just needed a little bit of fine-tuning. But So I wouldn't call this a bad game, but it's it's definitely not a, a great game. You can tell it wasn't a triple-A team behind it. Exactly. It was not a, you know, Nintendo, like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. there was just that, that polish was not there that, that a, a higher company... Like a Konami or or a, or a Taito or somebody would have put the good a good spin on it mm -hmm. to make yeah. it really like that good spit shine to really flush it out, make the hit detection crisper. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I, you can tell it was kind of a lower tier company making this game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's not saying that much considering there's worse on the Nintendo. So oh yeah, absolutely, and that's why we're saying like this is not I'm, terrible. I I'm going to put it in a perspective like this is that. As a kid, if I... Well, I mean, I probably would never have gotten this game as a kid just because my parents would have thought, like, oh, no, that's too violent. Why would I get you an R-rated game? Um, my parents but were like, let's go see Rainbow. If, yeah. I, <laughs> if I got this game as a kid, I would have loved it. I think I, I think I would have loved it. I think I would have, too. Yeah. yeah. Especially with the fact that you can get passwords. Oh, yeah. Any fucking time. Like, just that alone yes. was huge. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm always a sucker for that kind of shit. Yeah. So it's. I just kind of wish instead of having to be in dialogue, you could press start at any time. Yeah. To get your fucking. That was kind of a, that was kind of a questionable thing. Like you didn't Why think would you they do didn't that? they didn't have to do that. No. And honestly, if you didn't have the instructions, how would you even know to do that? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. that seems like such a goofy thing to do. Yeah. But I, I wonder. Know. I wonder how accurate their password system was because. I know that with uh, Didn't, there's no Broderbund. Yeah, it's Broderbund. It was <laughs> notorious for giving you bogus and and bad passwords. Yeah. So I wonder if if they were better at it. I don't know. 
but but I I'm but, gonna, I'm gonna agree on that four. But yeah, it's, it yeah. does have a few shining things. Like I said, a lot of dialogue for a game like this, which makes sense considering dialogue is your checkpoint. Mm-hmm. I'll give it that. I like the story to it. It did a good job yep. as far as setting up the world and how everything is going. Boom, nailed it. All right, great. But yeah, a lot of a lot of missteps. All right, so, so four for difficulty, four for fun. So that leads into. The question of, is it worth it? What did you pay for this? So Rambo, I actually got from somebody I know from a friend. Um, back when I was, first started like collecting Nintendo games, that's why I have it complete. Um, so I didn't actually pay anything for it. Nice. Yeah. Can't beat free. Yeah, but I mean, this was a game back back in the day. I don't know if it if it goes for more, but I mean, whenever I would go to a store, it was not rare at all. It was very common. You would see this game honestly for a dollar ninety nine, maybe two ninety nine. It wasn't expensive, but as of price chart or as of today, <laughs> price charting, God bless you, has this game for nine dollars and ninety nine cents loose. No, it's not it has not been hit no by <laughs> nope, people people have forgotten about this game yeah. and they do not care to be reminded of it <laughs> well i wonder if part of that is because i'm pretty sure avgn did a rambo one he did so i mean you know him and his stigma like once 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 he's made a video about how bad something is people tend to be like yep that game sucks never yeah. touching it yeah so i wonder if this is another case which of is such his... a shame it it's really such is. a shame it's sad that people kind well, of take stock in that and the funny thing is he's come out and said that like it's all just an act it's yeah. not like, well it's... he he's it's a comedy performance it's not a real true review yeah yeah well and then and that that happened actually that was like one of the very first times that i i really disagreed with him and, and thought like wow was he wrong about that was uh silver surfer mm -hmm. saying how terrible that game is and how it's one of the hardest games that was ever made and i'm just like yeah it's hard but if you memorize it it's actually very doable and the game is actually like it's it's pretty fun yeah. what was the one where you're the floating head zombie nation yeah zombie that nation. was another one that got a bad rap that... did he do zombie nation i don't know i don't he think he, i don't think he did though. i have no idea so, but yeah, I honestly ten bucks, ten bucks. I would say it's worth it. That's, yeah, that's not it's, too bad. it's fun. Yeah, I'll give you. As I'll give as, it. As far as a movie, uh, a, a movie tie-in, I think it's it's no Die Hard. Well, it's definitely not Die Hard. <laughs> but I feel like okay, you've actually seen Rambo: First Blood Part Two. Mm. It was it was more so what this was based on. Yeah. How accurate was it to the movie? Other than some of the enemies, it's not terribly far off so. okay so i mean as far as a movie tie-in you're getting a pretty faithful recreation of it did um, co die in the movie uh that i can't remember did okay. she move with him to the usa if, she, if i can't remember if she died i don't know because she wanted to live <laughs> life and love yeah, I don't know about that. And she loved John Rambo. But she I don't did. know, this is the continuing trend of taking R-rated things and making them for kids. So. That's Ain't true. that the truth? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I mean, they did it with what? Robocop? Pre uh, this. Toxic Crusader? Toxic yeah. Avengers? Yeah, Super like movie. how many of those like R-rated movies got cartoons and stuff? That's true. That weren't really meant well, for us. Toxic Crusaders, they, it was Toxic Avengers, and yeah. then they tried to market the video game a, a cartoon series right, and toys. Right. So, I mean, that's so yeah. bizarre. Rambo got a cartoon. <laughs> Yes, it did. And oh, it got yeah. a toy line, too. Yeah. yeah. I had the toy. So mm -hmm. weird. But yeah, $10. I think, it's I, worth honestly, it. I think it's that's worth, worth it. it. Oh, definitely that's worth it. That's not a bad price for it. Yeah. And this game, it's not rare. I still don't think it's rare, although I have not been looking for it. But, I mean, you go to any video game store, you're likely to find this on the shelf. I well, would say so. Not um, any, any retro game any store. Any retro game store, yes. And obviously. Cause, if I yes. went to GameStop, you'd be lying. Well, if you go to GameStop, you're not going to find anything. <laughs> well, I can find clothes. <laughs> yeah, really. That's you basically can, what yeah, they're in apparel find, store. You can find statues. It's basically gamer's version of Hot Topic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, very much so. <laughs> yeah. All right. I, I'm, uh, yeah. Not not the best experience you've ever had, but not the worst. Definitely that's for not the sure. worst. Definitely middle of the road. Yeah. yeah. A little mm -hmm. agitating here and there just because of how sloppy the game was executed. But mm -hmm. overall, not too terrible. No. No, I, I would say so. Yeah. I, I would agree. Wasn't the 15 hours that was promised. No. No. <laughs> so there you guys go. 
Hit us up on Facebook. Hit us up on Twitter. Go to powertripgaming.tv. It takes you directly to the channel where you can watch all of our other videos as we tackle the NES collection. Yes, you can. You can watch our side quest material too where we tackle games that aren't the NES. Or if you want, you can check us out on iTunes, Stitcher, and Spotify for our podcast, the PTG Powercast. If you don't want to contact us on social media, you can always shoot us an email at nespowertrip at gmail.com. Uh, don't blame you about that. Definitely not. So, next time on Power Trip, we will play something better. Will we? No. Uh, we'll play something better. That's a Power Trip promise. No, that, it's not. You're going to break that promise. That's a Power Trip promise. Power Trip we promise. Gotta, we got to go back to the United States. Go! I think you taught me. You taught me to love. Oh, my God. With the ending of it. Oh, with the ending of it. <gasps> really? I love you. Let's get married. <laughs> and then it should have just said the end. <coughs> Rambo and Co. got married and had four kids and lived a long, healthy life. <laughs> That's just funny. Wow. Booty was more important <laughs> than food. Than food. Booty. No, I'm serious. I like man. you and I want you. Booty. <laughs> I can't. Was more important than drinking water. <laughs> please, please, Johnson. <laughs> I fucking love him. <laughs>